<clears throat> Yo, what up, what up, what up, beautiful people, this is your boy, OPK Beats, the magic producer, you know, the only magician on the beat. Um, and I'm, and I'm here with a brand new tutorial on how to add swing onto your drums, you know, yeah, <clears throat> excuse me. So, um... I made I made a, a video tutorial on how to add swing onto drums. Yeah, and I could see a lot of comments saying they don't get it, they don't understand the idea, uh, and a whole lot, a whole lot, a whole lot. Yeah. So I just decided to update it, made another video, maybe a part two, you know, maybe a part two of it, so that people can really get the idea understand the concept of what i was trying to mean or what i was trying to show like i was showing at the part one on the first video yeah so without wasting much time let's just jump straight onto my door and see how things will go okay so i'm using studio one as i said earlier studio one and i have this beat it's actually a song I produced for someone, yeah, so... It's <laughs> all Pika Beats, the magic producer. yeah <clears throat> so it is what it is um so let's get straight to the tutorial um so i have my beats here this is my drums yeah this is my drums everything inside and i made it a pattern just like how you use your FL Studio, you just plot, you just draw your your beat, your your idea into sounds. You know, yeah. so my kick, my rim, my pick, my bongo, ride, Charlie. So let's just start it. So basically, this is how the beat will just sound when you just play it. Um, like a robotic style, you know, you just straight to the metronome, boom, pa, boom, pa, boom, pa, boom, pa, and um, swing is actually another like another name. You, you can use another name like a humanize humanizing effect, uh, just like a, a human being, like a drama is playing the drums. You no, know? everything will just everything won't go exactly to the metronome. We just delay some parts. Yeah, so that's what swings is about. So um, this is how it sounds like. Yeah, that's how it sounds like. This one is just straight to the metronome. Pa pa pa. Let me add the metronome. You see. This one is just like a robotic style of playing. Yeah. Um, so, to actually add a swing, you go here. This one is just straightforward. You know how to create a pattern, like how to create a pattern mode in Studio One. If you don't know, I have a couple of, I have a video on how to um, create pattern. And use it and use it for your drums and your other stuff so you, you can go back to watch it or you can just check up there yeah you check up there 
straight up you will find the the card that will lead you straight to the video yes you just watch so how to add the swing in a pattern mode like this pattern mode like this you go here swing you see at the top of the bar they have some place here swing sorry let me just reopen it again you double tap it double tap and it will bring it or you can simply press f2 on your keyboard yeah i mean your computer keyboard you know f2 it will bring your your sequencer um then you go here you see a place written swing swing yeah the swing is zero percent so i'll just add a few you can go up to any amount you want like when you are applying the swing here you can't see it you won't see it you just feel it so any amount that will make you like you make you feel okay i like this one yeah, you are good to go so i'll go for for the sake of the tutorial i'll go for 50 percent so that you know how the swings work 50 percent so let's play it again and let's do with a metronome on Can just feel it it's just a feeling you can just feel how the beat kind of drag a little from the pa, the next part you see how it drags so pa, 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 like it just drags huh. so back to zero the listening Then let me try the 50 again. Yeah. So that's simply just that. Just simply just that. So I would, I would, I like I like something like I, would, I like using the numbers like little numbers. So we just apply it very little to it. Very little to it. add my shakers so that you know how it feels with the shakers so with zero and with the 50 To the metronome so listen to the 50 this is 50 mm. so that's simply all just that it's not anything extraordinary like anything that will make you just think and blow blow your mind you see just a humanizing effect so i was kind of surprised when people were saying they don't they don't get it from my first video and other stuff okay. so that's just that simply just that so i have another pattern here a drum pattern here this one but this one i just use it on the native studio one like when you you want to play when you want to play your drums this what will just come in uh, when you just create this what will just come for the studio one the step sequencer yeah so you just come here um but this one you can pretty see it you can see it from the timings here Quantize, quantization lines here 
see this one this straight this one is straight this one is straight but this one is not on the straight line yeah exactly this one is not on this one straight line just shift that small and that's where the swings come so let me undo the swing here so just watch something i'll just press q on my keyboard q on my keyboard and to just quantize it and i know you know your shortcuts please you see as i press the q it just quantize the the notes straight on the line on the quantization line uh -huh. so this one is just a zero swing this one there's no swing so when you play it like this just falling straight on the metro on the quantization lines straight on the quantization lines there so with this if you want to add a swing the same thing this little bar here you go to the Q Q here yeah Q here so you just type it you see quantize you just type just sorry just click on it then you come straight here under it it says swings swing and it's zero percent here swing and it's zero percent so you just type your any amount of swing that you want so this one to let me go for 50 percent 50 percent swing and you see where the line has jumped to from here to here and that's 50 percent so let's say if i use the 25 see where it has come from here to here exactly so and it is not all it's just those milli 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 lines that will go this ones wouldn't go they will, they will stay in that so it's just these lines yeah just these lines so this line has moved when you come here this line will also move this line will also move ah, that is it and you can see it here this line has also moved so let me go for the 50 percent 50 percent so you see where the lines are this one has moved um, this one has also moved So the swings the lines that will move will be this the second one and the third sorry the second and the fourth the second and the fourth from let's say 0 to 0 0.2 this one is 0 0.1 0 0.2 so the first line will move the second will move the third will move the fourth will move sorry So after that after typing in the number of swing you want over here number of swing you want over here you come back to your stems you come back to your step sequencer you select all you select all your step sequencer like this or you just type control a on your keyboard your computer keyboard Control A. Hmm. Control A. Like this. Everything will just be selected. Then you type in for you to see. This one you can pretty see it. Yeah. But the other one you can't see it. You can't see it moving. With the the, the parting mode, you can't see it moving. But with this part, you can see it. So let me I will zoom it like this. You see where this one is? to come here so i'll just press the q on the keyboard like q so pa. you see as simple as that so it has moved from here it was right here someplace to this place so let's play it and see how this one two sounds you see Add the metronome, you see.
Yeah. So like that, like that, like that, like that, that like that. If you can't get this one, then I don't know how well you want me to explain this thing, this thing to you. Just simple like that. So let me go for the twenty-five percent. So let's take note. The ten is here. Oh, so the line is here. My step sequence. My my steps are here. My notes are here. So twenty-five percent. Twenty-five percent. See where the line is. So Control A will select all the notes. Then I'll press Q again. So you see that it will move from here this place to this place. So control Q boom like that. Like that. And then your swing. And your swing is just that. Your swing is just that. So let me play it with my shakers and see. Mm. Okay, guys, that's pretty it. Uh, that's pretty. It. That's how to add swing to your drums so simply that is that that's everything you have to know about swing to add swing to your drums yeah. that's everything you have to know okay so Thank you for watching. Uh, let me know everything that's. If you don't understand anything, drop it at the comment section. I'll read it. And this time around, I'll try to be consistent on this channel, on my page. Yeah. I'll read it. And I'll. Everything, anything that you don't understand, I'll just make, make a video on how to do that thing that particular thing so that you understand it okay so if you are new here subscribe to my channel yeah you can share this video for people to also watch it then like as well if you don't like the video dislike it then write it under the comment section why you dislike the video okay all right so big time sub Thanks you for watching. Peace.